We are receiving reports uh, hotly anticipated uh, before that the uh, Chancellor, Kwasi Kwarteng, has been sacked. Let's bring in immediately our deputy political editor. Sam, has he gone? Two sources say that Kwasi Kwarteng has been sacked as Chancellor. This isn't an official announcement. They're not doing that yet. We will get that, I suspect, fairly soon. But two sources now saying that Kwasi Kwarteng has lost his job. Huge uncertainty about what happens next because Liz Truss appears to have just sacked the man who was at her side all the way through the leadership contest, has been at her side in Cabinet for years and who has been on the same ideological journey as her for years, for a decade. And that means she is now trying to save her premiership by drawing a line under the last turbulent six weeks of her premiership and start afresh. Could it be Jeremy Hunt who comes in to replace Kwasi Kwarteng? Somebody very much not seen as ideologically aligned to Liz Truss, nevertheless uh, potentially seen by the party in the markets as a more safe pair of hands. Could it be somebody else? Again, no official confirmation. Two sources saying Kwasi Kwarteng has been sacked as Chancellor. But the question is, is it enough? Kwasi Kwarteng is being sacked. It would appear for uh, implementing uh, promises that Liz Truss, who you see in front of you, sitting next to Therese Coffey, the Deputy Prime Minister, promises that Liz Truss made during the leadership contest. And it does appear as if that essentially uh, now Liz Truss is trying to save her premiership by blaming her, we think, recently ex-Chancellor. Uh, the two of them looked like they were getting on, but there were other points where you could see stony faces from uh, Kwasi Kwarteng, either at conference, which you just uh, were looking at pictures of, uh, or indeed uh, out in Washington at that IMF summit. The blue book that Kwasi Kwarteng holding there is the book that essentially writes the story of his downfall. It is the mini budget, maxi budget really, uh, that he was heading uh, three weeks ago today to deliver in the House of Commons uh, that... Uh, essentially has rocked the markets, undermined confidence of Tory MPs, destabilised Downing Street and has led us to this extraordinary moment uh, with Kwasi Kwarteng looking like he's on the way out. Two sources saying that he has been uh, sacked as Chancellor.